the phrase, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. But what if your diet consists of only apples and nothing else? I mention this because today I'm talking about the apple diet. That's right, there is a diet out there consisting of only apples. It's not so much a diet, but a three-day detox or a three-day cleanse. It's an extreme diet for rapid weight loss. It's a single food complex diet. During my research, I also noticed that there is a five-day apple detox, but it includes other foods. So I'm just going to focus on the three-day just apple detox, cleanse, diet, whatever you want to call it. Any diet that brags that you can lose weight rapidly or fast by solely eating one food, that should be a huge red flag. Warning bells should go off in your mind, in your head, to avoid this diet. The apple diet is extremely low calorie. The average apple has less than 100 calories. If you're eating a large apple, it might have 100 to maybe 115 calories, depending on how large it is. While you're only allowed to eat apples, the amount is unlimited. You can eat as many apples as you want. When your diet consists of just one food, your stomach actually loses its ability to function properly, especially apples, which are so high in fiber. What happens is you do this detox, and once you go back to eating normal foods, your stomach actually slows down its ability to digest, to, you know, remove toxins from your body, aka poop. It actually slows down and limits the functioning of your body. One of the websites I was looking at while I was doing my research for this diet said the key to a successful apple diet is hydration. As I said earlier, apples are a great source of dietary fiber, so it will cleanse your colon, which is the plus side to this diet. At the same time, an overload of fiber isn't necessarily a good thing either. The, da the biggest downside to this diet is you're most likely to gain all the weight back after you're done with this apple cleanse. Yep. Another con to this diet is it destroys your nutrition. While you're allowed to eat as many apples as you want, no person really wants to constantly be eating apples day in and day out. You have to eat quite a lot of apples to get in your necessary calories for the day. On top of that, you might be doing workouts and you need more calories to be able to get through those workouts. And eating a whole lot of apples just doesn't seem practical. Another thing that was mentioned on one of these websites is you're told not to do intense workouts. But with the purpose of this diet to lose weight fast, people are not going to listen to that and they're still going to do intense workouts on top of eating such a low calorie diet to, in order to lose weight fast. Those are just the key points of the apple diet. Some pros, it does help with your colon. It does help to kind of cleanse your body in a way. There are some cons, destroying your nutrition, ruining your stomach's ability to digest properly. and add up. So this is an extreme diet. Extreme diets should not be carried out or lived out by people whose goal is to be healthy or to lose weight and be able to stay, sustain that weight loss because this is just not a sustainable diet. I of course took it to one step farther than extreme and made it more extreme. So what I did when I was on the apple diet, I ate three apples a day. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And that's it. I did tend to pick bigger apples, so there was probably about 100 calories per apple. So I was living off of 300 calories a day, which is nothing. That it was only during my research for this video that I realized that the apple diet is intended to be three days long. When I did it, it was about three weeks long. The first thing that happened to me while on the apple diet was I got sick my immune system became very weak from only eating three apples a day. I lived in a city, I took public transportation everywhere, so I was more susceptible to illness. 
I was exhausted. I had no energy whatsoever. It was so hard to get through the day without wanting to just fall asleep during class or on the train, you know. Even just walking those few blocks from my apartment to the grocery store to pick up my, my apples for the day, it was just so, it was a chore. It was a chore just to walk, you know, outside and down the street. Another side effect that I experienced was constipation. I, of course, at the time was not drinking water because I've never been someone to like drinking water, so why would I start then? I was only eating a food high in fiber so it actually built up and it was very hard for my body to pass the apples because of my weak digestion because of the food I was eating. The last thing I want to mention about this diet is it is extremely boring. Apples day in and day out oh my goodness, all you want is something different. Like you can change the apple and have a, like a green apple, like a Granny Smith apple one day, a honey crisp the next, the golden delicious, a Macintosh. You can switch it up and have every type of apple under the sun. It's still an apple. It still tastes like an apple. They're still apples and you're gonna get pretty sick of them and boring. That's probably why this diet is intended to be three days long rather than three weeks long. But me being the idiot that we all know I was, I took things way too far. I did things the worst way possible and it really messes, and it really messed with my mentality which was already fucked up at that point. The apple diet, if you do it, do it for the three days and be done with it. Keep in mind, you are probably going to gain back all the weight you lost, plus some. That's usually how it works with these extreme diets. Definitely do your research before going on the apple diet or any diet. If it says you can lose weight fast and it makes you rely on a single food, think about it for a second. Really, really do your research. That's, that's my biggest... That's my biggest thing I wish people did more before they jumped into some fad diet is do your research. Learn what you're doing. Learn how it's going to affect your body. Read the pros. Read the cons. Just learn about it. Gain as much knowledge before, you know, making a hasty decision. These diets are intended for people who are desperate. Is apples are great. I love apples, but they need to be part of your diet not your whole diet. Anyway, thank you so much for clicking on the video. I really appreciate you taking a little bit of time to listen to me talk about diets and all that fun stuff. My name's Raven, in case you didn't know that, and I will see you next time. Bye!